This is the just announced Coros Pace 2 Elliott Kipchoge edition. This is the model used by Elliott in his gold medal winning marathon at the Tokyo 2020 Olympics, but now it's in a special color combination. Coros were kind enough to send me this review unit, but this video is not sponsored and I do not get to keep the watch afterwards, sadly. I have a full review of the Coros Pace 2 on my channel if you want to know more in depth about the watch itself. If you haven't seen that, I will link it up here and down here. This will just be an overview of the Elliott Kipchoge Special Edition. The first thing you will notice is that it comes in this rather large box which is roughly about twice the size of the standard Pace 2 box. On the top of the box is a picture of the man himself as well as his signature and a picture of the watch and a little clue as to why the box might be a little bigger than the regular one. If we flip the box over there's nothing on the bottom and there's nothing on the two long sides but you can see there is a little hint of what is inside on the ends but we'll get to those in a minute. So if we open up the box the first thing you will see is this card. Again it features a picture of Elliot as well as a little statement from him and at the bottom you can see his still quite frankly unbelievable sub two hour marathon time. On the back is the Coros logo and nothing else. So if we put that to one side, underneath that you can see there is some paperwork for the Coros Pod or Performance Optimization Device, which you can see here comes in the box. If you're not sure what this device is, then again, there's a video on my channel all about it. I will leave linked up here and down here. Basically, it allows you to track some additional metrics that the watch doesn't track on its own. And these include things like your cadence and your left and right balance. You just simply attach it to the back of your waistband and then it will connect to the watch and that information will be fed back into the Coros app. Ordinarily, this item is sold separately, but for this special edition, they've included it in the box. So you can see you get the device itself as well as the clip that attaches it to the back of your waistband that the device fits into. And you also get a battery to power the device. Next up is the nylon band, which features some of the colors from the Kenyan flag, which if you didn't know is where Kipchoge is from. Usually these nylon bands only come in black, white or navy. If we remove the foam piece underneath, you will find a box for the charger. There's nothing special about this. It's exactly the same as the standard one in the standard Pace 2. Next to that is a box with all the paperwork inside of it. So you've got your warranty, your quick start guide and a sticker. That's it for everything on the left hand side of the box. So let's move on to the right hand side of the box where it's time for the main event. Here you can see the watch itself. It has this nice hashtag explore perfection screen protector on it. And if we peel that off, we can see custom graphics on the glass again with those colors from the Kenyan flag. By now you should be able to see a bit of a theme. Both the back button and the digital dial are also in custom colors being green and red respectively. What you will notice is the watch already has a strap attached because in addition to the nylon one that we just looked at, it also comes with a silicon watch strap. Yes, there are two straps in the box. The buckle end of the strap is accented in red and the other end is accented in green. So you get this nice contrast between the green and red on either side of the strap. But that's not all. Following the setup of the watch, which works just the same as any other Coros watch, which is nice and simple and relatively quick, you will notice that you get a custom watch face. Again, this is gonna feature those same red and green colors with a black background and it looks pretty smart. I should point out that you can actually change the colors of this watch face. You just use the dial and scroll through the colors until you find one that you're happy with. Obviously, it's not gonna match the watch strap anymore if you do that but it's an option. You can also change it entirely for one of the pre-programmed ones found in the app. When I reviewed the Pace 2, I only had the nylon strap and having used this silicon one for a couple of weeks now, I can say that I really like it. 
The long end of the strap is actually held in two places. Not only is it held at the end like most watch straps are, but it also has a built-in pass-through on the buckle so there's no danger of it coming undone very easily. This is something I have actually had problems with on some other running watches that I've tested. So really pleased with this silicon version. The Koros Pace 2 Elliott Kipchoge Edition comes with $300 worth of Koros gear. Remember, you're getting two watch straps rather than just one, and you're also getting the Koros Pod, which is usually sold separately. All of this will retail at a price of just $249.99, and there will be just 5,000 produced globally. So if you want one, I think you better get in line pretty quick. And that's pretty much it. Everything else about this version is the same as the standard version. So again, if you want to know more about that, just go and watch the video linked below. Keep your eyes peeled to the channel for some other Coros announcement related videos coming very soon, as well as a test of the Coros Evo Lab feature released earlier in the year. That's it for this one. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.